Guys, what's up? This is your boy John from Colder Ice, and you know what? Hey, check this out. I wanted to show you kind of what's going on because it's a little bit annoying to me. And um, so let's take a quick look over here at Facebook, and I'll and I'll explain. All right. So basically, if I go to my group, which is the Colder Ice, uh, or not the Colder Ice group, this is the uh, uh, other page. I want to go to the e-commerce group. All right, if I go to the e-commerce group, I'm going to show you something that's going on right now. There is a request for people to sign up right now that says five requests. And oftentimes, I'll get the notification right here when somebody wants to sign up for the group. And it's saying these many people asked to join the group. So when you go in, you can see who the people are that are trying to join your groups. And I'm noticing something, especially right recently since they started adding suggested groups to the right hand side of the columns is that people are starting to spam a lot of the groups and I've noticed this one in particular see this picture right here actually that's the same lady all three of these are the same picture of the same woman and then if you also notice if I hover over it the background you see how it is in the background it's just some garbage crap and her photo same here there it is next one photo garbage crap and and basically that's all the same woman and if I actually look at that ID you can see that it's the same picture over and over and over again so this person has these 13 pictures or so of a headshot and they use that to create these fake Facebook IDs alright and then they go out and they join hundreds hundreds of groups and start spamming the group with crazy stuff. I'm talking about pornography stuff, you know, buy, you know, sex toys, all this kind of crap. So what you want to look for to make it really, really easy is just look for that lady's picture and that thing in the background and just turn her off. Don't let them in the group because as soon as you let them in the group, What's going to happen is they are going to start spamming your group. So all you got to do is hit reject, reject, and reject. Now this one right here kind of looks a little suspicious to me too. Let's just check out this one. And this is how you might see if somebody is probably most likely a spammer. So again, you've got a picture. You don't even have a picture of a person. And you have no background image. Then you see, if you look at her profile, this picture was uploaded five hours ago, five hours ago, five hours ago, uh, February 7th, that's a long time ago, and it's in Chinese, September 27th. Most likely, this person is not a real person, and again, if you look at the number of groups this person is in, it's 60 groups, that's probably a good sign to let you know that this is another one of those spammers. So that's some kind of easy way for you to do your research and check out if somebody's really trying to get in your group to spam it. Make sure that they have a real ID and it's got real traffic. They're actually talking to people on that site. All right. Before I go, I want to tell you about the Hump Day Hangout. We'll be talking about things just like this on Wednesday, 2 o'clock. It's absolutely free. It's on Google Hangouts. You can get to this event simply by going to this link colderice.com slash hump dash day dash hangout. Yeah, I know. It's long, but you'll never forget hump day hangout after you type all that in, right? Anyway, go over there, register. If you register right now, it's kind of cool because you can register. Um, and if you do register, I will give you a free gift of a 77-page ebook. So uh, go out there, register. Share it with your friends and get the free book. All right? I'll talk to you on Wednesday, 2 o'clock. This is your boy, John. Peace!